Welcome to the Fearless Floyd Show. As always, I am your host, Fearless Floyd. Today is Friday, July 26th, 2024. As you see from your screen, this is part two of Border Czar. This is just a quick little intro. I'm going to do a deep dive in this next video. But just for simplicity's sakes, I wanted to show you exactly what was up with Kamala Harris. So you can see it in a hot two minutes. And right here, this is March 24th, 2021. President Joe Biden has tapped Vice President Kamala Harris to lead the White House effort to tackle the migration challenge at the U.S. southern border and work with Central American nations to address root causes of the problem. All right, so two things. To tackle the migration challenge at the U.S. border and work with Central American nations to, to address the root causes of the problem. Biden made the announcement as he and Harris met at the White House on Wednesday with Health and Human Services Secretary Xavier Bercera, Homeland Security Secretary Alejandra Mayorkas, and other immigration advisors to discuss the increase in migrants, including many unaccompanied minors arriving at the border in recent weeks. Basically, I'm going to go over these fact sheets, and I'm going to tell you more about it. And we're going to go into this, and I want to show you real quick. Partnership for Central America, put this in here, boom, 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 this stuff pops up. Wow, U.S. pays little attention to Latin America, China has moved in. This is from May 8th, 2024. The construction of ports in Latin America by China are illustrative of Beijing's ambitions for strengthening its footprint around the world and definitely around the United States. And guess who is educating all of those poor Latinos down there that are going to be working in these ports? Like, subscribe, share, hit that notification bell. Leave a comment below. Coming right back at you live. Borders are part two.